Hey guys, you know what time it is. It's my favorite video to make, possibly ever. It's an unbagging of this month's Ipsy, which I just got. I must confess, I have seen some of the items that are in this. I don't know if they're all the same, but I saw my friend's Instagram and I was like, darn it. Then it made me excited because I was like, that means mine's coming. Mine's coming. And I checked my tracking and it was today, tomorrow, yesterday. When I checked yesterday, it was today which was tomorrow, yesterday. That was confusing. I also just want to apologize. This video won't be edited in any way, so it'll have all this long crap in there and all, like, any mistakes I make, because I don't know what I did, but uh, I lost my Windows Movie Maker, which is where I edit my videos, because I'm lame and it's easy for me and it's simple. So if you guys have any programs I could use that are similar to that, that are easy, I downloaded a couple, but I just not, could not, get the hang of them. They were really confusing and I don't know. Oof. This is times like these I wish I had a Mac so I could get iMovie but I don't. So if you suggest iMovie I can't use that. So I need Windows editing programs that I can use that are really simple like that an 8th grader, 8th grader could use you know like simple things. 8 year old even for for dumb people. I'm not good with editing things. No. Mm -mm. Anyway, this has been long enough to begin with. Let's just get to the real part of the video. So, I'm pretty excited to get in here and get the bag out. Is there any other papers in? No, nope, no. So, this is this month's bag. It's like a nice blue with some like makeup items on it. Like silhouettes of makeup items. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I do like the colors. There are some nice colors. So let's get inside. Alright, first we have our, our thing. I don't... tags. Yep, okay. Next. First item. 3-in-1 Revolution. Toner, serum, and moisturizer in one. And it says Lee Annie. I don't... It does. that's all it says is Lee Annie. And this is... This container's kind of cute. It's weird. I've never... Like, the top's a lot bigger. So, let's see what's inside. Ooh. Ooh. It's really, like, a really runny. So, this is some moisturizer that you... Like, it's just like a whipped... Like, it's like a lotion, but a little bit thicker. Not totally thick, but I'm making a mess anywhere. It doesn't really have a scent to it, which is good, so maybe I can use it on my face. I think it's where you're supposed to use it. Yeah, because it's a toner. I can tone this up. So, it's by Lee Annie, and you can go to leeannie.com, so maybe I'll go and check and see what exactly you're supposed to do with that. Next, we have Elizabeth Mott Smooth Shadow Creamy Eye Pencil. This is what it looks like in the box, and there's no color on the outside of the box. So let's open it and see what the color is. Ooh. Okay. Penny. It's called Penny. So it's a nice coppery color. I like that because I've been really into bronzes and coppers. Ooh. I don't know if you can tell, but it is real nice. I'll put it to the light. Look at that. It's really shiny and sparkly and shimmery. It's kind of like the one we got from, uh, Crap, that eye pencil we got that was like the amethyst or whatever is really shiny silver. I like that. This is going to be a nice like accent like eyeliner underneath because I like to put a little eyeliner underneath to brighten it up. So this is going to be, this going to be nice. Next item is from Makeup Beauty Cosmetics. Alright. Tinted Limp Balm. Limp. Lip Balm. Tinted Lip Balm. In Fiesta. This is the container. It's, it's kind of nice. It's not as bright as I thought it was going to be. Let's do a little swatchy swatchy on my hand. Oh. Alright. It's completely different when you put it on your hand. Look at that. It's like a dark pink mauve color. That's nice. I don't know if I'm bold enough to wear it because this is as dark as I go, I think. But that comes off a lot sassier than it looks in the container. Alright. Next item is... Oh yeah, just what I like. These are makeup cleansing tissues and they're from Absolute with an exclamation point. And it says cucumber extract, so ugh, I don't know. It might be too scenty for me. 
So these are some makeup wipes. It's just a little trial. This says there's 10 in here, which is a good amount. So I'll open them up and see what they smell like. All right, it's not too strong. It is more of a just cucumber cleansy smell. It's not like a cucumber, yeah, cucumber melon, which is sometimes way too strong. Yeah, this is a nice smell. Maybe I'll try these tonight and see how these work. So, yes, I'm always here for makeup cleansing towelettes because I'm always on the search to find the right ones. Because my face, I put on so much makeup, it's hard to get it off, and my pores are so big, it just sticks right in there. So it's hard for me to find towelettes that actually work. So I use like two different kinds to get all the makeup off. So, yes. And this last one is. Soy Tri Wheat Leave In Conditioner from Sexy Hair. It says improve formula with soy and cocoa. Ooh. That's kind of weird. Soy Tri Wheat. I don't know. That's a lot of ingredients in there. Let's give it a little spray. I'll spray it on my hand. I don't care. My arm is going to be all conditioned. It doesn't smell like what I thought it would smell like. I was waiting for chocolatey smell because it's a cocoa. It smells just like a cleaner. Like, not a bad cleaner. Like, if you mix hairspray and a cleaner together, that's what it gets. I'm not good smelly. You guys know I'm not good with, uh, not good with the smelly, so. Well. Yeah, I do like the colors brown and aqua are, like, my fave colors combo, like, Gray and pink, brown and aqua. But anyway, this is pretty nice. I don't know if I'll use it because I'm not into leaving conditioner because, like, the, maybe for the tips of my hair because you usually can tell, these get really dry, but the top of my hair gets greasy really easily. So, I could probably try this on the tips of my hair. I don't know. But anyway, overall, I enjoyed this bag. Like, this is much better than last month's. Like, I had so much hope for December because it was Christmassy and I'm like, oh yeah, we will get some awesome stuff for Christmas. But it really, that's why I didn't make a video on it because I just got so disappointed that I didn't even want to upload the video because I really wasn't into it. But this month, I'm really excited to try this out because this is something different. I don't know, like, I don't, well, I don't know any of these brands except for the sexy hair. But I think all of these are winners except for, I don't know what the heck is going to happen with this moisturizer serum toner. It's weird. I'm going to look that up. Yeah. And I'm pretty excited about this lip gloss. I mean, if anything, I can save this for my cut. Yeah, my cousins, my stepsister's wedding because the rest is at this light pink, so a darker pink lip. I don't know. Maybe that's a little crazy. Maybe if I start tanning, get darker, it'll be nice. But this is like, I like the little container of it. It's plastic, so it's not going to, well, it might break on you, but it's not too bad. And I especially like this eye pencil like because it's so sparkly and you guys know how attracted I get to sparkly things I mean it's only like trial size so there's the fault there but ooh, oops if I like it enough I might get a full size I'm going to check it out because I don't know how expensive Elizabeth Mott is but definitely excited about these face wipes and I'm kind of excited about this so overall this bag was pretty awesome so if you guys got this month's ipsy bag comment down below and let me know if you guys liked it because I did so anyways sorry about this video not being edited it's kind of long but anyways hope you guys have a great day it's almost the weekend and I love you guys bye